combination of issues and focus. Yesterday we were talking politics. This is the week that the GOP, as a grand old party, is meeting in Tampa, Florida to talk convention and, of course, make Willard Mitt Romney their official nominee for presidential elections as we talk November 6, 2012. 11, 6, 2012, that's the big day. So this week in Tampa, Florida, delegates from across the country, as in GOP, delegates, Republicans, Tea Party members, are in Tampa, putting together their platform and, of course, making, crowning, as we would say in the, in, in the cliche, crowning Mitt Romney King, because he will become officially not only the nominee for the presidential election, but also the head of the Republican Party, as we know it. The issues are many, because as I said, the goal is to get President Barack Obama out of office, make him a one-term president. The issues are, of course, Romney Care or Obamacare, the economy, the job situation is still sliding, we don't know where that will go. Medicare, Medicaid is now a part of the issue because the vice presidential candidate who has been selected, Paul Ryan, a, congress, a congressman who has been, you know, look, looking to cut Medicaid over the years. Nevertheless, my goal today for wanting to talk with you is to hear your point of view. Uh, will the Romney Ryan ticket be the ticket to defeat Barack Hussein Obama? Uh, is a younger guy, a bolder guy, a more conservative guy the answer to the issue? We remember 2008 with uh, McCain and Sarah Palin, and we thought she could cut the deal. It didn't, the sale was not made. So my question to you is, join me on Twitter, at Verna Politics, on Facebook, at Verna Politics, and of course, on YouTube, at P1915, as we talk politics. Let me know, do you think that R&R, &R, not in rest and recreation, but as in Romney and Ryan, will be the ticket to make President Obama a one-term president, or as some people say, for the Republicans, that is just a pipe dream. Want to hear your point of view? Join the conversation. I am Bernie Smith, and this has been Issues in Focus. Thank you.